But why, should, why would you say that mining investment will rise when you put a 57% tax on? Well, I haven't looked carefully at the, at the modelling. Some people say that the model just has built into it um, an assumption that investment will be constant. Um, I haven't looked at that. This is the KPMG uh, EconTech uh, uh, model. Um, they may also be saying that mining would be rising anyway, given the China boom. Um, not that the tax would cause a rise, but it would be rising anyway and the tax won't diminish from it. That You, 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 you could argue that. But um, one thing I don't think you can argue with is this proposition. That whatever investment was going to be absent this new tax, it will be less with this new tax. I, I, I don't think you can dispute that proposition. Um, because the way... Uh, the global mining companies work is they have so much as for their capex budget. Um, they determine that they'll spend say 20 billion, 30 billion over the next X number of years. And then they just look at it project from project, region from region, country by country. And the truth of the matter is if you've got 20 billion in capex and a new nickel mine in Brazil will give you a better return than a new uh, nickel mine in Western Australia, the capex goes to Brazil. That's, that's the bottom line. That's, that's how global mining works. So what, whatever the investment was going to be absent this tax, one thing we can say for sure is it will be less with this tax. There was a lot in the, the, in the report that Ken Henry and his panel put out on the future tax system, one of which was the resource rent tax that you talk about. I mean, the assumption after uh, Wayne Swan made his uh, response to it that Sunday, uh, the assumption was that Ken Henry was unhappy because a bit had been plucked out of it and the rest of it had been uh, ignored. And there are all these pictures of Ken Henry looking grumpy. Um, do you think uh, it was wrong to just pluck something out of it like that? I mean, can you, do, do you sort of um, side with, if, if Ken Henry is grumpy about that, do you think that's, he's got something to be grumpy about? Oh, I think, I think um, Ken Henry is entitled to feel grumpy. He's, he's, he's sent away, he's asked to do a root and branch, I think was the expression, review of the taxation system. He comes back with it um, and, and the root is ignored and the branch is ignored. <laughs> so so w what was the point of that? Um, I think he has every reason to feel grumpy um, and you know to, to, to have him there and for him to stand, stand mute. As, as his report is buried, uh, I think, you know, it was bad form. And what did you think of his report? Well, you see, the thing about tax reform is it, 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 it's like a balloon. You, you push it down here, it goes up there. You push it down there, it comes up here. Everything interrelates. The income tax system interrelates into the welfare system. Um, the, 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 the company tax interrelates in, into dividend imputation. Um, the way you tax capital gains inter, interrelates into uh, the way you tax uh, uh, income through, through, through other entities like trusts. Um, everything interrelates. And when you are trying to design tax reform, you, you've got to design it as a whole. Um, and if you just take one bit, you can actually make the, the remaining bit worse, not better. So when I did tax reform in, uh, in 1998, we had a new GST. But only because we were abolishing wholesale sales tax, bank account debits tax, financial institutions duty, stamp duty on shares, stamp duty on mortgages, uh, stamp duties on leases. Um, they, a GST they, wouldn't have been good in itself. It was only good because it allowed you to get rid of these other things. Now, if you want to go down the resource rent tax, just whacking a resource, new resource rent tax in is wrong. But if you had said a resource rent tax will replace, replace royalties, which will be abolished, um, 
you know, and, and you had added in a whole lot of other design features. You, 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 you could have ameliorated it. But if you just want to plonk a new tax on the existing system, you can make things worse, not better. And that's what I think they've done. Uh, to, to me, tax reform means um, getting rid of taxes, cutting taxes, simplifying taxes. That's what tax reform is. What do we get? We've got no simplification. You know, one thing I can tell you is this, is Kevin Rudd and Wayne Spawn can't, un can't explain a resource super profits tax. Got no idea how it operates. I mean, it's, it's excruciating trying to uh, listen to them explain it. Um, complex, on top of the existing system, um, with, with, with no corresponding abolition. So, Ken Henry will think to himself, my root and branch got rooted. <laughs> <laughs>